that's your wedding. What mm. made you decide to go and marry yourself and not just do it, ask for gifts? <laughs> Which I love that part. <laughs> I love that. Yeah, I mean, it wasn't really about the gifts, you know? <laughs> it was just like, how to uh, how do I acknowledge and celebrate choosing myself and choosing integrity versus having to be with someone just to have someone there? Did this decision have anything to do with a breakup I, or you know, age? Right. I think um, both. You know, I was married in my twenties to another person, <laughs> and <laughs> <laughs> and and I realized it was more of a friendship. And so as I hit 30, I was like, I'm gonna choose comfort or integrity. And I went with integrity. Why did you believe it was a matter of integrity for you? Um, just like not being in something, just to be in something, just because society says that's what you should do. Um, this is what life is supposed to look like. And our life looked really great, but on the inside, it was pretty lonely. Tell me what the reaction was from friends and family. To marrying myself? Yeah. Um, yeah, my friends were totally on board. What uh, about your family? My family definitely wants me to be happy. You know, I grew up in the Midwest, so focusing on yourself is not really the thing you're meant to do. So my dad was like, like are you for real? Is this for real? <laughs> and, and how did you convince him that, you, no, I'm serious about this. I, I want to marry myself. Um, I mean, he went with it, you know? <laughs> He's, he's a cheerleader. <laughs> well, I like the good Midwest parenting. They're like, let me cheer it on. This gentleman here in the break, he said, you know, what about men? Is this something that you find, you've written about it, Glennis, that we're hearing from mostly women, or are men doing this too? What about men doing? Doing this, yes. Are men oh, yeah. pursuing this I think this culturally, as well? there's... Lo the <laughs> there's oh, you married yourself? Oh, hold on. Oh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> hold the phone. Let me get you to stand up. I'm sorry to reach over you, ma'am. So you married yourself? Yes, I did eight years ago. You did, wow. and you have a ring. <laughs> oh, what made you decide to do that? Integrity. Integrity. You yep. didn't want to be in a bad relationship. I didn't want anybody telling me absolutely anything. I make my own choices. I decide my own move. Mm -hmm. I decide what's next for me. How old are you? 53. 50, oh, you look great, thank you. <laughs> I, I mean, I didn't even know he was in the audience here. I thought you were saying, what about men? You've actually pursued this. Um, again, going back to your look at the future, are you close to the idea of entering a, I don't mm. like the word traditional marriage, but <laughs> I mean, would you get married to someone else <laughs> at some point in time? Yes, I mean, you know, it's not legally binding. I like to say it's an open <laughs> marriage. Um, I date. <laughs> Um, yeah, I'm definitely open to that, uh -huh. but I, I want to do it for the right reasons. I, I know we have some more questions in the audience. You, oh, you took, let me, oh, okay, come on over here. What's your question? What's your name? My name is Nina. So it's really a comment. I'm really relating to a lot of this because a, a few weeks ago, I actually deleted um, all of my online dating profiles oh. off, my, off my phone because I found over the last few months this, this cumulative um, feeling afterwards that I wasn't feeling good about the interactions mm -hmm. with the men sending inappropriate messages mm -hmm. and oh. or not replying or just feeling icky about it. And I'm like, I don't feel good about this. Right. I rather choose my own happiness and do something else to the point where I was like, okay, you're gonna do you, I'm gonna do me. Yeah. And if we're good, then we'll be good together. And we'll do I, we'll do we. Yeah. So I am looking for that kind of You're looking for that. <laughs> Ma'am, you had a question as well. Let me get you to stand up. What's your name? I'm Stacy. Stacy, what's your question? So I am commend you for the decisions that you guys have made. And just, I'm all for self-love, self-care, self-respect. Mm -hmm. But uh, I'm also curious the logistics of it. Like, did you send invitations? Did you get yourself a ring? Did you celebrate an anniversary? Just very curious mm -hmm. about that. Thank yeah, you. I mean, some people have gone, you know, taken it further and had like a hundred guests and you know, they're wearing like a, a proper gown and everything. I emailed invites. I think, you know, weddings can start to be an inconvenience. And expensive. And very expensive. I was like, this is gonna be cheap and yeah. easy and fun. And so that was my focus. I did take myself on a honeymoon the year <laughs> later <laughs> um, to Mexico. Um, which was also is my birthday too, and I was like, wait, why am I? And you have a ring. I do. Yes. When you I when do. people ask you, are you married? You say yes. Um, I say to myself. That's 